Hello, my name is Dean Morrell, and I'm a marketing manager for Agco, or for Hate Tools. With me today is Kevin Cobb. I'm the product ma marketing manager for the Challenger Combine. The um, Today we're introducing a uh, concept unit, a, an R&D product, which is a combination of a combine and large square baler used for the collection of biomass. The, uh, the unit is uh, shown this fall in production, uh, harvesting corn cobs and uh, also the, uh, the mog or the uh, material other than grain that goes with the corn cobs. And we um, uh, have shown that and will continue the, the pursuit of collection of the biomass for not only for the ethanol industry, but also going into other heat sources and also for uh, livestock production uses. Uh, the combine itself is a class seven 670B combine. Uh, we also use the class 8 combine, the 680B combine, to uh, pull the baler and it is modified to drive the baler hydraulically and then we also use a delivery system from the combine that uh, delivers the material into the baler itself. I'll let Dean take over as far as introducing uh, uh, what all we are doing on the baler and the advantages of the large square baler for transport. Okay, we've taken our standard baler, the uh, LB34B baler, and we've done some modification with it. If you look off to the side here, we've done some modification as far as bringing the crop from the combine into the baler. And so we've taken our standard baler, we've made some modifications to be able to deliver that crop back into the baler itself to be able to produce a mog bale. A mog bale of what we consider is 75% is, uh, cob, 25% mog would be material other than uh, the corn but as you go through the baler the way it's set up and that's it we continue to bale at a high density bale okay the high density bale is used for transportation when we talk about moving corn cobs and, and corn mog around we want to be able to transport it at a, uh, a lower cost and be able to efficient way to be able to where we can move these to these ethanol plants a lot of things we found out as we've done a lot of testing this fall with the baler and that's that we've been able to then take this mog bale and go into other applications as far as customers with feeding livestock. Here's a clean system to put up clean mog bales to feed for livestock and also then for bedding and other things that, that farmers would use this far. So our concept here today is to continue to um, move forward and, and develop this project to be able to go here. And we're at, we're at Ag Connect today, and we're here showing the baler with the combine for this purpose. 